To initiate a phone call, simply dial the outgoing digits on the dial pad. This could be true for an internal or external call. The phone will automatically go to speakerphone when you press dial or the send button. We have an active call, we know, because we have a solid green light against our call appearance button. If available, we'll see the caller ID and the call duration. The bottom of the display shows end call, new call, and transfer. To place the call on hold, select the button with the two lines through it. Your call appearance button begins to flash green. The bottom of the display has refreshed. You can select Resume to pick the call back up, or press the Hold button again. A held call is exclusive to your phone. We have an active call we know because there's a solid green indicator against our call appearance button. If available, we'll see the caller ID and the call duration. We can place a call on hold, which is exclusive to our phone, or we can use one of the park buttons that have been pre-programmed. If a park button is lit green, it implies that it's vacant. Select it once, and it will flash red, and the call has now been parked. You can go to any other phone and press the red park button to pick the call up. When the call has been retrieved, the park button will then turn green, indicating that it's vacant. If a call is parked at another phone, you will see that the park button has turned red, indicating that it's in use. We have an active call, we know, because we have a solid green light against our call button on the top left. If available, we'll see the caller ID and the call duration. The bottom of the display shows a menu where you can end the call, initiate a new call, or transfer. Selecting transfer refreshes the menu options and allows you to blind transfer. Selecting that, you can dial an extension and select Blind Transfer, and the call has been transferred to your colleague. If unanswered, in most cases, it will end up in the user's mailbox. Another option is to select an attended transfer or a supervised transfer. Doing this allows you to dial the intended party, allow them to answer, and you're able to converse with them and announce the party that you wish to transfer to them. To complete the transfer, select the transfer button from the bottom of the display. To transfer directly into a colleague's mailbox, select Transfer, select Blind Transfer, dial 03 and the party's extension, and select Blind Transfer again. The transferred call will go directly into your colleague's mailbox. We have an active call, we know, because we have a solid green indicator against our call appearance button. If another call comes in, 
it will ring on the second call. This is shown with an alerting red light, and if available, the caller ID, name and number will be shown on the bottom of the display. Select Answer, and you automatically put the first call on hold. You can select either line button to toggle between the two calls, We have an active call, we know, because we have a solid green light against our Call Appearance button. The bottom of the display shows End Call, New Call, and Transfer. To add a third party, select the Conference button indicated by the icon of three people on the right side of the phone. Next, dial the digits of the party you wish to add, and select Dial or Send. When the party answers, announce to them that you would like them to join a conference. Select the conference button a second time to join all parties. Now that you're in a conference, the bottom of the display will indicate kick. This allows you to remove one party from the call. You can toggle left or right to see the different parties and select submit to drop that party from the call, 